We're going to talk about the Sunny 16 reel today. And the Sunny 16 reel states that on a bright sunny day when you're photographing something in direct sunshine, match your ISO setting with your shutter speed as close as possible and your aperture should be f16 for the correct exposure. So for instance if you have your shutter on 125th of a second match this with your nearest ISO setting which will be 100 and your aperture should be f16 for the correct exposure. If your shutter is on 500th of a second your nearest ISO in that circumstance will be 400 and again your aperture should be f16 for the correct exposure. The Sunny 16 rule is a really useful rule to memorise and if you're having problems with your camera meter or viewing your exposure scale or you can't see your histogram on the back of the camera then this rule will prevent you overexposing your photos on a bright day and blowing out all the details. A good way of judging how bright the sun is is to look at shadows and how well defined they are. For instance if a shadow is dark and has well defined edges then the sun is at its brightest. It's not blocked by clouds, it's not diffused in any way and the sunny 16 rule will apply. Now if the shadow softens and the edges become less pronounced and blurry then you would open your aperture by one stop to say f11 and as it softens further maybe to f8 or 5.6 if the shadow has almost disappeared. Use the sunny 16 rule as a rule of thumb and to double check the reading that camera meter is giving you is the correct one. But it's a fun one to practice and play about with.